Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play More Fire Emblem. Alright, let's. Uh, hmm, who should I attack? Go with you, I guess. about fire. Nah. She's level 8. Wow. Looks like that's pretty much it. You know what? Let's have Jill go over here. Perfect. Curses. They just keep coming. How many soldiers does he have? There's no telling. He is a bishop and a senator, and he holds a peerage, and that means he could command many men. Commander, what do you think about calling in reinforcements? Uh, it's not a bad idea. While we wait, uh, we could take a breather and reorganize our attack strategy. Let's do it. something too. It came from the northeast. It's unlike anything I've ever heard. To the northeast? Ah, there are our ruins over there. Perhaps the white prince found them to be a good hiding place. Uh, let's check it out. Maybe we can find him and escape while the humans fight amongst themselves. What are those humans thinking? Why would they be trying to lop each other's heads off? Shall I make an inquiry? Leave them. They're nothing but trouble. I second that. Now, if we want to avoid the human skirmish, we should head that away through these trees. Let's go. Yes, sir. All right, let's figure out where to go next. Brother! What is it, Mist? Just now, do you hear a sound? Huh? No, nothing special. Really? I guess it was just me then. That sound you heard, was it high-pitched, like the chiming of a bell? Uh, uh, yes, it was. That's it exactly. I didn't hear a thing. It created only a slight disturbance in the air. It could only be heard by those possessed of extraordinary hearing. So, your sister's hearing is on par with that of the Lagoots. Wow, did you hear that? Neat. Don't let it go to your head. Sound that Bjork can't hear. It's interesting. It is said that those of the Heron clan are all practitioners of seed magic. Perhaps this sound is related to that? Seed magic? What's that? It involves arcane songs known as Galdrar. The effects of Galdrar on the listeners depend on the lyrics and melody. For example, a Galdr can restore loss, strength, and vitality of those who hear it. The singers of royal blood, the Galdr may be powerful enough to move its listeners to extraordinary feats. I've even heard tales of a Galdr that could give one the speed to do the work of two men. The Galdrar grant many powers. Wow, that sounds incredible, doesn't it, Ike? 
Yeah, but even with all that power, they were still wiped out by the Bjork. Right. Herons are highly attuned to the forces of balance. Even if they had the means to resist, I doubt they would have used them. We leave as soon as our reinforcements arrive. Duke Tenez must not succeed. Let's rescue the Heron while there is time. Alright. We should head towards the ruins in the northeast. I sense something odd there. Got it. Thanks for the information. It is nothing. It is only natural to aid one's companions. I couldn't agree more. Cursed humans. I dare you to defile this forest again. I will brook their savagery no more. The forest whispered earlier. But I must drive these wretches out before I can speak to it further. I will go to the altar. I will give voice to the forbidden magic and destroy the humans utterly. Alright, so we get reinforcements. Let's have Oscar and Astra join us. Uh, they, they have their weapons. There they are. Crimean mercenaries. Surround them! They must all die! Well, here comes the, uh, mounted units. Listen, everyone. We must make our way to the ruins to the northeast. Fight if you must, but keep up! Ike, what about the reinforcements? They'll have to catch up. We can't wait any longer. Understood. And you can't, um move your units either. Or, um, like, reposition them, is what I'm trying to say. You can move them, obviously. Ike, he's still not level 20. We gotta get him leveled up. Probably gave her a uh, steel axe, maybe. you to the level uh, 20 here. Good. One more level. Not bad. Yes, you need to heal, 
our eyes. Question. Mephany, I see you take out this guy. Now, the problem I'm going to have here is with these other mounted units that are coming. They look pretty scary, to be honest. One of them even has a bow. to go after the bow. Okay, it looks like he's not going to be able to reach. Ah, oh, of course. All right. Survive! This guy's dead. How dare you face Titania! Like, she wasn't able to double him. And he got healed back up. Of course. What the heck? Really? A physics staff? Everyone alright? Hang in there! I'll be with you in a moment! As a fellow citizen of Benyon, I find this situation deplorable. Repent now if you like. Your time grows short. Alright, now what? Get him! Definitely! Here, though, um, get this guy. You get this guy. Nice. We'll be okay. All right, let's give this one more try here. No oh, damage. Beautiful. He's gonna get healed again, obviously. Dang it! 
Oh! She's actually able to double with the axe. <laughs> no damage. And he's a beast. I don't even. Yeah, he's gonna get healed again. Alright, well that's going to be it for this episode, guys. We'll finish this off next time. Godspeed, stay frosty. See you.